There are many factors that influence where we choose to settle down and build our communities. Some of these factors are cultural, such as religious or family ties, while others are economic, such as access to resources or job opportunities. But one factor that often gets overlooked is the environment. The environment plays a huge role in where we choose to settle. For example, some areas may have a more favorable climate with mild temperatures and abundant natural resources. These areas are often more attractive to people as they offer a better quality of life. Australia is an example of one of these places. The country has a diverse range of climates and a wide variety of natural resources. This, along with the mild and temperate climate in most of the country, has led to the development of large cities and towns, such as Sydney and Melbourne, as well as many smaller towns and rural areas. Additionally, Australia is known for its beautiful beaches, diverse wildlife, and unique landscapes, which attract many tourists and immigrants. The Great Barrier Reef, the world's largest coral reef system, and the outback, the remote, arid interior of the continent, are two examples of iconic natural resources that draw people to this country. On the other hand, areas with harsh climates, such as deserts or polar regions, are often less hospitable and therefore less likely to be settled by humans. The environment can also influence the type of settlement that is built, such as whether it's a city, a suburb, or a rural area. One extreme example of this is Antarctica. Antarctica is the coldest, driest, and windiest continent on Earth, with temperatures reaching as low as negative 89 degrees Celsius and no permanent human population. The harsh climate, along with the lack of resources, makes it difficult for human habitation and it's only visited by researchers and support staff during the summer months. But the environment isn't just about temperature and natural resources. It also includes factors such as access to clean water, fertile soil for farming, and proximity to transportation routes. These factors can all influence where we choose to settle and have likely influenced why your community developed to be where it is today. So here's a challenge for you. Think about the physical environmental factors that have influenced the development of your community as a settlement. Your task is to think about your own community and research three physical environmental factors that have played a role in how it's been developed. These factors can include things like the climate, topography, natural resources, bodies of water, and more. Once you've gathered the information, explain your findings and why you think each factor has been significant to the development of your community. Write a short report or create a slideshow explaining all of this information. You may wish to search for your community on Google Earth so that you can see the surrounding landscape and make predictions about any factors that may have shaped human settlement there. Be prepared to share your report with the class and discuss the results. Good luck.